Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Erin Cusson and today I have a Reformation haul. Uh, so this is a brand that I haven't had too much experience in, but I got a few pieces. I'm eager to show them to you. Um, and they all uh, have the square neck, which is something that I am really into. Um, I've always been a fan of the square neck, um, as I touched on in my last anthropology haul. Um, and actually, in addition to the Reformation pieces, I have a few other square neck tops that I want to show you, just to kind of show you, you know, um, you know, some of the some of the, my favorite aspects of those tops. So, having said that, let's just jump right in. Okay, so the first top we have is the uh, Rosa top in the color black. This is a 3X and it was on sale for $39. Okay guys, so I wanna start out by saying that I have had to make some alterations with these, with all these tops, and honestly with pretty much all square tops that I buy. For some reason, the shoulders um, don't stay up on me, and I just can't stand constantly having to pull them up. So I actually sew a little tie in the back to keep the sleeves kind of pulled up. So you're going to see that on pretty much all of these tops. Um, I I do often have to do some alterations with my with my clothing. Um, so this is just one of those things that I do. If you don't like it, just ignore it. Um, but I will through each top. I will talk about how well the sleeves stay up on their own. Um, just so it's something you guys can kind of keep in mind if you decide to make any purchases. So, okay, let's talk about this top. So this is a 3X. Now, I think I am commonly going to be a 2X uh, in Reformation. However, with this top, the description said that it was fitted, um, and so I decided to go with a 3X, and I'm glad that I did because I feel like if I had gotten a 2X, this would have been um, a bit too tight. So as you can see, it is the square neck. Um, I'm currently wearing one of those stick-on bras. Um, it's not doing the best job, but you know, we work with what we got, right? So anyway, um, yeah, so it's got, you know, covers my, my arms, which, you know, I appreciate. Um, has a good amount of stretch in it. Let me turn around and show you the back. So I just sewed a little piece of like, you know, lace on there to kind of tie it together. I, you know, it, I didn't do the best job, but honestly, I'm still kind of working with that. In my opinion, this top wouldn't fully stay up like comfortably on me anyway um, without these ties. Um, the question would be, if I size down, would they still stay up? For me, the answer is no. <laughs> um, I have some other tops that actually fit pretty, you know, snug, um, and they still don't stay up. So, anyway, it's probably just my shoulders. But, uh, yeah, so, yeah, this is the Gaia top. Um, and I'm not really sure what I'll say about this one. I like it. I think it's cute. Um, I don't think I would have paid full price for it. I think it was, most of their stuff is pretty pricey, but on clearance or on sale, um, I'm definitely happy with it. So let's move on to my next item. So the next item we have is the, uh, this is the Gaia bodysuit in black. This is a 2X and it was on sale for $20 and 40 cents sorry about that so um so this is a bodysuit um, i actually threw it on with my american eagle uh jeans so again this is another one where i put like a lace strap in the back um just to make it more comfortable um and so i don't have to keep worrying about the, the shoulders sliding down which is again something i can't stand um, so yeah, so again, another square neck. Um, I think the 2X fits pretty well. Honestly, I think I'm kind of right in the middle 
of a 2x and a 3x. So I wish they made like a 2.5x because I think that that would fit me perfectly. But unfortunately they don't. So um, let me do a spin. I'm going to show you the back and I'm going to kind of show you a little bit of how it looks. Um, down. So yeah, so as you can see, I just, you know, a little piece of lace. Um, very comfy, very stretchy. Um, I think this is just a great basic. Um, I definitely like a layering piece. Um, so let me show you just a little peek. So this comes down to about, sorry guys, I don't want to like pull my whole pants down or anything. But um, it, it comes like just, there's a little bit of tummy space kind of kind of sticking out. So, um, you know, I have like black panties on, but um, I don't know. I, you know, I think it fits good. Um, but like I said, I, you know, I guess maybe I would prefer if it was a little bit more coverage down there to where it kind of went like all the way down. Um, I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about, but either way, hey, for 20 bucks, I think this was an, a, a great deal, um, especially for Reformation, which if you guys know is always pretty pricey. Uh, so yeah, cute little bodysuit. Um, something I'd probably wear often and very comfy, guys. Like I said, lots of stretch. Uh, so yeah, let's move on to our next item. So the next item we have here is a is the Gemma bodysuit black 2x and was on sale for $14.40. So this is definitely something I'd wear in the warmer months. Um, it is a bodysuit. 2x fits I think perfectly with this one. Um, I really love that the, the straps are thick enough to where I could probably wear a, an actual, like a real bra, um, instead of these stick on thingamajiggies. So yeah, very comfy. Um, could pair this with a lot of different things. I'm thinking like a cool skirt. I changed into like my American Eagle mom jeans and just threw on like some bigger hoops for like a casual look, probably with some combat boots, maybe like my um, faux leather black jacket. Um, but just a really good quality bodysuit, I think. And for the price, can't really beat it. So let me do a spin. Now this one, guys, obviously I didn't have to make any adjustments to um, because I think it, it, you know, it obviously stays up on its own. Uh, so yeah, just a cute little, cute little bodysuit. Well, you know. Gives me some room on the tummy, so I don't feel restricted. Um, I think it, it's a good, like, as far as, like, the weight of the material, I think it kind of, um, you know, some body suits, you can kind of see every, like, little nook and cranny, <laughs> like, on my on my tummy. But with this, I don't know. I think it, I think it does a good job at, you know, kind of making things look all right. So anyway, okay, we are gonna just move right on to our next item. Okay, so the next item is the Sadie Top in Ivory. This is a 2X um, and it was $64. Okay, so this one I'm torn on everybody. So maybe you guys could give me some feedback on this one because I'm kinda torn on it. So first of all, the material is kinda scratchy. It's definitely not soft, um, and the thought of wearing this, like in the summer, uh, maybe is like definitely, a, I wouldn't even consider it. It's just the material is maybe in the spring or the fall. But anyway, love the square top. Now this one I have not altered in any way um, because I wasn't sure if I was gonna keep it or not. Uh, I think the 2X fits good. It is definitely, fitted. It's a substantial material. Um, this is a very, is pretty substantial. Um, and so if you are between sizes, um, I would probably size up in this one just because this part is pretty fitted. Um, 
in my opinion at least. And then of course, I'm gonna have issues. These are gonna fall down. Um, there's a lot of fidgeting that kind of goes on. Um, but all in all, it's a beautiful top. I wish it was a little bit softer. As far as it being lined, so it is, let me see here. I feel like it's got this like lining. Oh yes, yeah, so it's double, so it's got like a double, you know, I don't know what that's called, but um, so I don't know, you guys will notice if you can kind of see through it or not. Again, I've got the stickies on, I think with a nude bra, um, a full coverage nude bra, you wouldn't be able to see anything at all. Um, so the sleeves have a good bit of stretch. Um, so that's a good thing. Love the like puffy sleeve. Really cute. Let me turn around and show you guys the back. You know, I think it's a beautiful top, um, but I don't know. I guess I'm just not sure how much I will wear it because like I said, it's kind of, it's a little bit itchy. So yeah, you guys, again, tell me what you think about this one because I am just not sure. Also, like the underarm area is kind of tight underneath my arms, which makes it kind of, I don't know, it's just not the perfect fit. Um, I do wonder if I did put in a, a lace or a little tie in the back, if that would help with my comfort as far as constantly feeling like these are falling. Um, so I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, yeah, pretty top. Love the square neck, guys. I'm just really digging it right now. I think it's I think it's very flattering. I think that this also, um, this kind of like top is also very flattering. Um, so yeah, okay, let's move on. This is the last final Reformation top, but I do have a couple of others. I've got a couple from uh, ASOS, I think American Eagle, and one from Nordstrom's. So let's just hop right into those. So the next top we have here is from American Eagle. This is the square neck smocked peasant top. This is an extra large and um, I had gotten it on sale for $15.99. So this top has a kind of a long story to it. Saw it on somebody online and fell in love with the color, but they were sold out um, completely sold out, kept watching, watching. Finally, an extra large came back into stock, and so I jumped on it. Now, mind you, I am commonly always an extra, extra large in um, most American Eagle tops. So I had a feeling this was going to be way too small on me. Um, so I got it. It fit, but it was, it wasn't comfortable. Like I knew I wouldn't wear it a lot. You guys know me, I have to be comfy. Um, so what I did was they had the same top on eBay in like, I think a small or a medium for pretty cheap. Went on, bought that, and then altered this top to fit me. Um, so as you guys can see here, um, it is altered. I add, there's a panel sort of added in to give me some more room on both sides. So anyway, so like I said, this is an extra large, but really it's like an extra, extra large because there's added fabric to it, a little bit of added fabric to it. So let's talk about the top. I think this is gorgeous. I love the um, square neck detail on this one. The sleeves I think are absolutely gorgeous. Love this color, this like smoky, dusty purple. Purple is one of my favorite colors, so um, yeah. So this one is cropped. I'm not huge on crop tops, um, but with my high-waisted, uh, most of my pants and jeans are high-waisted, so it's fine. These are actually my anthropology um, corduroys. So let me turn around and show you the back. Um, so yeah, this one I think has a tie with it, which is nice. It holds the shoulders up. Um, just really a beautiful square neck peasant top. So yeah, not too much more to say about this one, long story, but I love it. And to me, it was 
worth the extra added effort. So yeah, okay, let's just move on to the next item. So the next item I have is from Nordstrom's. Um, got this at Nordstrom's online. This is the brand BP, um, which I'm not really familiar with. This is the smocked peplum crop top. This is the black ditzy print in a 3X and was $29.40, which was on sale. Um, so this is, I think, just a really cute, again, square neck, loving the square neck. Um, I'll come in a little bit so you can see the print. It has pale pinks, um, some rust colors, a little bit of yellow. So let me just kind of bring you in. Get a close up on the print. Can you see it? Okay, cute print. I um, think it goes good with um, some rust pants or even the, the pants I have on. I think it's cute. So the 3X, I think um, I could have probably gotten a 2X, um, but actually I think the 3X fits pretty good. Now mind you, again, I had to alter this one though to keep the um, shoulders up. So let me show you that. So I had to put a tie in the back. I chose like some like off-white lace stuff that I had lying around. So I thought it matched kind of. Um, so if I didn't have that on it, these sleeves would be completely falling down because they are pretty loose up here. So that's just something to keep in mind. Um, but yeah, just a really cute, um, affordable square neck option. So like this one. Uh, all right, let's move on to the next. Okay guys, so this is a little bit of a more um, dressy option. This is from ASOS. Um, this is um, the Outrageous Fortune Square Neck Bodysuit with Sheer Sleeves. This is a size 18 and was $16.50. Um, so, I really love this. Um, I am commonly an 18 in ASOS curve. Um, or ASOS. Um, sometimes in pants or jeans, I'm a 20. Uh, but it really, honestly, it really depends. But commonly an 18. So in this top, it has these beautiful sheer sleeves. Um, this thing, keep, these keep falling down. So if I was to keep this, um, I'm definitely going to have to put um, an, an alteration in the back because I just have no patience for the constant falling. But anyway, beautiful square neck. Um, love this one because it has this ruching. Um, it doesn't go down all the way. It's kind of just on the bust. Um, I'm wearing this with my mod cloth skirt that I had previously showed you guys. This is actually a 2X. I had previously purchased the 3X, if you guys remember. Um, but yeah, just, just I think a, a cute, a really pretty... Um, going out, maybe going out to a nice dinner, um, or, you know, I don't know, going out dancing. Um, I paired this with my Express um, earrings, and yeah, let me turn around, let me do a little spin with my spinny kind of skirt. Um, yeah, just a really beautiful, this is very comfy, um, it's not scratchy. Um, you might assume that it would be, but it's not. Lots of stretch in these sleeves, guys. Look how much stretch this is. So if you have um, bigger arms like I do, um, this definitely offers ample room. So yeah, I think I'll keep it, and I think I will try to put um, just a nice piece of um, black sheer material to keep up the sleeves. Ooh, okay, so we have one more item. And that'll about wrap up our um, Reformation square neck haul. So let me go get that. Okay, final item. So this is less than, this isn't exactly a square neck, um, but it kind of has a similar sort of effect. So I figured I'd just throw it in just to show you guys. Um, this is the Fashion Union, this is from ASOS. Um, it's the Fashion Union, Union Milk Made Dress. This is a size 18. 
um, and retails for $56. So I purchased this dress um, to wear for New Year's. Um, however, first of all, it didn't arrive on time. And then we ended up not going out for New Year's. So um, needless to say, now I have this cute little black dress. Um, and so I either have to return it or find somewhere to wear it. So you guys tell me what you think about this one. Um, not sure if I should keep it or return it. Um, so it has this really cute milkmaid thing going on in the bust area. Um, it's got a sheer um, little sleeve that has like little polka dot things on it. Um, and it has the stretchy, um, you know, stretch up here, elastic. So this again, uh, if I was to keep this, I would have to alter it in the back because it definitely does not stay up on its own. Um, it's a little bit big in the bust area. Don't know if that would be different if I had like a push-up, probably would be different if I had like a push-up bra on or something like that. Um, so this tie is a non-functional tie. Um, let me, goes a little past my knees. So let me do a spin for you guys. You can see it's not the best fitting dress on me. Um, I think it's very cute, um, but it just doesn't fit me so great. But I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe I'll try it on with a different bra and see how it kind of works. Um, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think about this one. Uh, let me see. It is lined, so it does have a lining. has this like sheer dotted um, mesh and then it's lined. Um, just cute little black dress. So anyway, all right, let's wrap this up. Um, this has been um, another great video. I want to thank you guys for joining me. Um, I always love all your feedback and your comments. Um, I don't know if you noticed in my last video, but we did add some links in there. Um, and we are continuing to, to um, perfect that process. So I want you guys to know that I am hearing you and doing my best to apply your feedback. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment. Um, and if you want, you can share. But anyway, thanks again for joining me, and I will see you guys next time.